Okay, so this is Tammy again. I, my camera keeps going further and further that way. Hi, um, this is my third and final coaster pour today, uh, set of four. Um, this will be video number 34, I think, on my YouTube channel, Allie's Pour House. Um, I'm going to use primarily blues, two greens and a gold and I'm going to do the balloon pour again um, but in smaller puddles and using a small little silicon ball that I have. So I'm going to be using an ultramarine blue that has some pearlescence mixed into it. I'm going to use Arteza Pearl Glacier Blue here. I'm gonna use ultramarine here, Arteza Gold, and Jenkins Golden's Jenkins Green, which is a green green, with this little piggy, oops, here, this little piggy asparagus. And these are the ones that shine, these pigments, they shine and, this has a green color to it and it's got a gold in there and you can see darker colors like this jenkins oops jenkins green in there i've already put isopropyl 91 percent alcohol on here cleaned off the tiles i have put a base coat of white and i'm also going to be pouring oops i seem to be losing the tightness of this a little bit. I'm also going to be pouring on an old coaster that we've had for, I don't know, 30 years or something that was just kind of looking tired and old. I'm gonna pour on that too. So why not? <laughs> okay, you guys, um, let's, let's create a little magic here, I hope. So first I'm gonna start out with a two paint which would be ultramarine blue. And I'm gonna put some puddles. I think I'm gonna put a couple of puddles so I can connect the flowers. That's what they're supposed to be. We'll see. I never know what I'm going to end up with. And I've been doing this for quite some time. So your guess is as good as mine. Um, next, I'm going to do... Um, 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 um. That's doing a nice little disappearing act. Um, I think I'm going to do the, this little piggy in asparagus. Oops. And... There and in that one. So I'm doing little puddles on each because what I'd like to do is put paint on these puddles, smash them down with a small balloon doing, I mean a small ball, sorry, doing kind of like a balloon kiss and then connect them. And that's a lot of asparagus going on here, darn it. That's way more than I needed, but this stuff is so thick. Okay, there's a lot of asparagus on here. So then I'm gonna put some Golden Jenkins Green. And kind of connect them. Golden's Jenkins Green. Golden's Jenkins Green. Golden's Jenkins Green. A darker kind of a dark mossy color okay that's all I'm gonna put of that then pearl essence ultramarine pearl essence I don't know it's probably st stuck in there but let's see if I can get some out yeah there it comes so I'm going to put some of that on there. That's a pretty rich color. 
I really like that a lot. Almost kind of wishing I'd put uh, some sapphire in here, but that's okay. We'll make these a little bit lighter. Okay, there's that. And um, gold. Gold. This is Arteza gold. It's a really pretty gold. These are going to be interesting looking. <laughs> I don't know. I think they'll turn out okay, but we'll see. Okay, gold. All right, then ultramarine, which is a beautiful, darker, rich blue. Squeeze bottles are a fluid artist's best brand, let me tell you. And then I want to finish with the Arteza Pearl Glacier Blue. Now that's kind of interesting. Now wait a minute, that shouldn't be looking like that at all. That was really liquidy. See, it doesn't even have the blue coming out. What the heck? I put marbles in my squeeze bottles, so if I have to shake them, the marbles help too. And I got these tips from other painters, but the marbles help to really mix up the paints really well in the squeeze bottles. Let's put some blue on there since that was mainly liquid. Okay, so hopefully, ta-da. All right, now I'm gonna use this little ball to squish. <laughs> I need to do it. <laughs> I need to hold on to it. I didn't hurt anything, but I could have. If I'd had my composition done, I would have been just a little bit upset with myself. <laughs> okay, so let's squish. Let's squish. Hmm. Oh, goodness. Lift up when you're doing the squish, the kiss. 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 Oops. These are almost looking like pansies, is what they're looking like. Hmm, interesting. They're actually really pretty. I kind of would like to use the, I should have had a small canvas ready to take the, look at that. I'm gonna put another one on there. I don't wanna waste that paint. It's really beautiful, actually. So, don't, oops. Hmm, very interesting. Told you, I am so messy. My goodness. These are probably going to end up being, oh, my favorites. <laughs> okay, let's try this. Goodness sakes. I really like these. I 
wrote down what I was doing and I'm going to remember that because, um, oopsies, that went in the, darn it, that just went in my pail of soapy water. Hmm. These are really quite stunning. to get there okay so um, I'm gonna put this away it's actually turning out to be an excellent color combination I was a little concerned about it the gold seems to have gotten kind of swallowed up a little bit which I'm surprised at but my goodness these are really Quite beautiful. I don't really want to mess with them much more. See what I'm talking about? Can you see that? Kind of connect them just a little bit. This one has hardly anything on it, but I don't mind that at all because it's what it does have is really quite stunning. So, can you see that? The colors are beautiful. I used a lot of gold metallic, the pearlescent blue, which is kind of a metallic. And then the asparagus, which is a highly pigmented um, mica and pigments, um, which makes it very shiny and bright and beautiful. So I am at this point in time going to stop myself from ruining them. And I really like the way they look. So. There you have it, you guys. This is my third and final video for today. Tomorrow on 10-21-2021, I'm going to try to do a um, another large balloon kiss. Yeah. Let's see how that works out. Okay, you guys. Have a good day. Have a good night. See you next time. Bye.